Anthony, we had a, a pretty smart guy on earlier uh, talking about whether a digital U.S. dollar, whether it's a digital Chinese yuan, why would that, would that either be a negative or a positive for Bitcoin? He said it would be a positive for Bitcoin to base a currency on blockchain because that's just the way to do it. But I, I don't know why that would be, I don't know how both coexist. How do you make the case that that would be additive for Bitcoin if there was an alternative that was a, a U.S. dollar? And number two, did you know a crypto punk? I've, got, I've been called a crypto punk, and I'm sure you've been called a crypto punk. Uh, did you know that was an NFT? I just thought it was something. I think O'Leary, Kevin O'Leary called you a crypto punk on, on one of those videos, oh. didn't <laughs> no, no, he, anyway. He, he, uh, he called me, I, I think he referred to it as garbage, uh, if I remember correctly. But no, listen, if You're we go back punk. kind of in the archives, yeah, in, in 2018 or 2019, I, I was on your guys' show, and uh, I specifically stated that the United States should rush and should immediately digitize the dollar. And my logic behind that was, one, other countries are going to digitize their currency, and so it's an accessibility. If all of a sudden there are digital uh, fiat currencies that people in places like Venezuela, Zimbabwe, et cetera, have access to, they're looking for safety. But if they can't get access to U.S. dollars, they're going to go find these other fiat currencies. And so digitizing the dollar ends up being uh, a way to continue to keep access uh, of the U.S. dollar on a global scale. Now, what that also does is it very, very quickly kind of ushers in this era of digital wallets. So if the dollar is digitized, everyone needs a digital wallet, and that likely will serve as a massive tailwind for Bitcoin as well. And so again, I think it's not so much either or. I really think that we've got to be careful about understanding every single currency will be digitized in the future. The competition is not going to be on the technology layer. The competition is going to move to that monetary policy layer. And ultimately, what I think you see is the fiat currencies, the monetary policy is not going to change. Just the technology is going to go to this digital format, but the currencies are the exact same. And so this belief that right. digital sound money or Bitcoin will end up kind of accruing value, I think, is still a valid thesis.